guys, I'm Nicola. I'm Hugh. And this is Soul Life and is look back at our week in Seoul, possibly weeks. How long have we been living in Seoul for? Already six months. Seriously, the other day I was like, yeah, we've been in Seoul for like three, three months. I was telling someone and then Hugh was like, no, we've been here for six months months wow it does not feel like that at all not at all like time goes so fast <laughs> before we get started you guys might have heard about the youtube glitch yes it is definitely a real thing we can see that in our stats all our friends can see it in their analytics so what happens is when we upload a video we lose a bunch of subscribers and it's active subs active subscribers being unsubscribed so just make sure that you are still subscribed to us because i'm getting so many messages from people being like i was unsubscribed to your channel i didn't want to be you need to make sure that you are still subscribed until youtube fixes this please like our video yeah hit the like thingy try your button yeah try your button Okay, we've been downstairs like underground and my friends are messaging saying it's snowing, it's snowing So we finally came up, we were downstairs for something and now oh my God. Look, it's not even a little bit of snow, it's like so much snow and this is the first snow of the season So exciting! Wow! Look at this! Last weekend there was an event for YouTubers in Korea, right? Yes. And we all got free Hanbok, so this was a very cool thing that was sort of encouraging and rewarding YouTubers in Korea that are promoting Korea and that type of thing. So it's about 50 YouTubers went and we all got Hanbok and this was your first Hanbok, right? Yes. <laughs> How is it that I've had a Hanbok before you've had a Hanbok? Because as a Korean, we don't think we need it mm. and we don't really wear it much. Mm. So, and it's quite expensive, yeah, so true. we don't really think to buy one. And the, usually women have them more than guys have them. Yes. Yeah, yeah, like women will wear them, have to wear them to uh, weddings, uh, but men don't really have to. You just, just wear, wear suits. Suit. You wear suits, yeah. Yes. So we were all given like these little award things as well for like promoting Korea. And also one of the reasons why we were given the hanbok, it technically comes from the government, is that we can wear hanboks in videos yeah and it's more about like promoting korea and all that type of stuff yes. so that was a really fun event hey i'm here with sarah Hi, and guys. we're actually at a youtube event where there's a bunch of other youtubers look at these beautiful girls i can't breathe <laughs> everybody looks beautiful in these beautiful hanboks it's all foreigner youtubers in korea yeah. and we're wearing hanboks for something hi <laughs> Baby, you have a hanbok finally. Yes. And Jay as well. And look at their shoes. <laughs> that's, that's lovely. Don't show people that. <laughs> Edit that out. Yeah, you guys look like you're in like a like a Joseon Dynasty hip hop group. <laughs> So maybe next video we should actually wear our unbox in the video. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> Let's actually do that. We have a YouTube community on Facebook mm. called YouTubers in Korea. It's like foreigners or Koreans who speak mm. English or another language mm. and they make video about Korea in mm. Korea or mm. something 
about Korea. Encouraging community. Yes. As well. And that's what's been really great in recent months because Korea has had sort of a lack of a YouTube community. Yeah. But like these days we're all coming together and we're doing stuff together and it's really great. And I want you guys to check out other people's YouTube channels in Korea because I feel like there's so many smaller channels that deserve a chance. Yeah. Um, and so like, you know, doesn't matter what somebody's subscriber count is, just look at their content. If you like their content, subscribe because we really want everybody to grow together and to have a really awesome community like that. Hey guys, where are, where are you? We are vlogging today. Um, we're going to Ilsan to see Han and Sophie and Alice and Gyo and Sarah's coming as well. But I want to buy these special cheese tarts that they have here in Hapjong first before we go. So I'm going, going to do that. Matcha! 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 Okay, it's actually much later now, and Han and Hugh did a video with Sarah. Where is Sarah? Yeah. Here is Sarah. So, what did you guys do a video about? We did Korean uh, and Australian, uh, well, English tongue twisters. Tongue twisters. How yeah. was it? Ah, uh, I did. I got nearly all of them wrong except the Korean <laughs> one that was in English. And I heard Hugh managed to say asshole a few times. I think Han got it in <laughs> as well. Okay, here's Han. <laughs> Hello. He's Sophie and Gyo. Awesome. Awesome. And here is Alice. 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 Yeah. Check out. Here. Annyeong. <laughs> so we're going to eat now. We're starving. Um, it's about zero degrees Celsius. So it's kind of difficult filming outside at these times. But now we're going to go inside and eat. What's up, Han? Can What's up? Can you What's up? It's a freaking cold and outside of Ilsam and it's freaking windy. I'm freezing. <laughs> Great. Way. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Han. <laughs> nah, she's shutting you down. <laughs> no! Okay, what are we going to eat? Uh, Can you explain what that is for people? Seolongtang is Seolongtang. Okay, that great, great explanation. Sarah, this is the best bit about Korea is taking your shoes off, isn't it? It's gonna it? take me like half, you can always tell the Westerners because we spend like half an hour taking your shoes off. That's right. At least I do. Here, bagel pa. Here's Gyo. Oh, So Sarah has gone back to Australia now. She's actually currently filming stuff in Australia now for her YouTube series. So next year that comes out. So we'll promote it, but make sure you like look out for that because that's going to be really awesome. The contrast really between awesome. Australia and Korea. So she filmed a bunch of stuff in Korea of like, this is how you do this stuff in Korea or this is food in Korea. Mm. And then she's contrasting it with Australia and Joel is hel helping her out in Australia with that. Mm. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Instead of answering some questions, I thought we could just do some recommendations. So I wanted to recommend a book but I don't have any good books to recommend at the moment. So why don't you recommend me some books in the comment section? Okay, what would you like to recommend? I would like to recommend a TV show, mm -hmm. new TV show in Korea mm. called Dokkebi. Yeah, so 
we've seen the first few episodes of that one. It's really new. So Dokkabi, you might recognize that word from Korean folklore and also in my webtoon, I have a character that is a Dokkabi. But the character of the Dokkabi in this drama is a little bit different to mine. I'm gonna put their faces here. Really different. So usually Dokkabi, like they translate it as goblin, but goblin is very much like Western folklore. So I think they should have just kept the word, the title as Dokkabi. But it is a sort of monster type character, right? Monster yes. kind of trickster or naughty types of girl. Like character, character yeah. Thing. Like yeah. God slash like supernatural being slash monster yeah. like that um but why does he not actually look like a dokkabi he just looks like a handsome guy he's dokkabi he <laughs> looks like dokkabi cool looking <laughs> handsome looking dokkabi but if someone says you look like a dokkabi that's not uh, uh, that's not a compliment but i think now is kind of a compliment <laughs> if someone say it like that it's changing the folklore around this but yeah. it's actually a really good drama i have not watched a korean drama properly in over a year because i got so sick of the same sort of storylines but this one is so different from everything else the other thing i want to recommend is these triple ginger snaps from trader joe's there is no trader joe's in korea but i order these online and they are so good because it's like three it's like ginger puree crystallized ginger and ground ginger i love ginger so much do you like ginger no no hugh does not like these at all but yeah if anyone wants to send me more of these please do oh what was the other thing that you wanted to recommend bts okay but you've already talked about bts so many times when i asked him i'm like oh do you have something you want to recommend to people and he was like bts <sighs> they know people know <laughs> Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe if you haven't already or if YouTube has unsubbed you without you knowing it. Please hit the subscribe button and check out the social media and the comics on the blog and or the social media. The social, I already said that. And the webtoon online webtoon and we'll see you later. Bye. 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 <laughs>